All right, welcome back in. We are today going to show you how to make that. So I figured out how to run the piping so that it uh, goes right into your uh, purifier. And this comes from a long line of, don't even get me started on running these pipes. Uh, I'm, I'm getting better on them, but man, it's a, it's a challenge because we can't change where the socket is. So one socket's against the wall, the other socket's not against the wall, and yeah. So this comes from outside. I've got double collectors. They go into double tanks. I use the large tank, or I should should say the tank because it doesn't say large on it. Uh, because it comes out the top and the small ones come out the bottom, which makes no sense at all. But anyways, and I come up here, pipe runs, pipe runs, pipe runs, pipe all the way, and it comes into here. Now, a word of caution. This doesn't actually function. As you can tell, there is no dirty water in this side of the purifier. But it looks cool and looks like it functions. I'm going to show you a simpler way to do this today. Uh, but to still get the pretty cool look, it's going to be this one. And I think it's really cool. It looks the part. Yes, you can tell there's no dirty water in here, so it's clearly not working. Also, the pipe hasn't changed in color. Uh, when they're connected properly, they change in color to whatever that color is, kind of a taupe brown or something. So we're going to show you today. So right over here, so you're going to need pipe socket, you're going to need a water purifier, and you're going to need one pipe or more if you want to do more. You find a spot. Now on this, it makes a difference. You do not want the tennis ball side being out. You want the socket being out because it has to do with direction. So we're going to pop that right there. Now I'm going to go into here. I'm going to grab my purifier and I'm going to do my best to center this under it because that's just an OCD thing and I need to get it a certain distance apart. In fact, let me show you that first so that you know. I'm going to set this like there just for now. The pipes have a minimum distance. I want the tennis ball connected to it. Now if I don't touch it, that's the minimum. I could not have that purifier any higher, but a way you can do this, it's kind of hard to center it because of the way your mouse moves, but try to get it as plumb as I can. I need to maybe turn my mouse sensitivity down. So, I think that looks pretty good. It's not far enough to show the the little arrow pointing down, but that's okay. I'm not worried about that. So we're going to pick this up. We're going to change to this, and then we're going to merge this. So obviously you see how this has the lines over it. That's the grid lines. I'm going to bring the grid line up just like this. I just wanted to come up a little bit. I don't need it to go crazy, like maybe right below the collar. There you go. How cool is that? And it works. It works in the respects that you can trick people. Wait until there's just a little bit on the right hand side. So right about now, it says purification proce process. Take a screenshot. It's still full on the left. So it looks like, now see now it's coming down. But it looked like for a moment that this was completely full and it was filling this up through the pipe. So it's really cool. Unfortunately, now I have that sticking off of this side. So you don't really want to do it on a wall where you can't hide that. But that does give you another place that you can put more pipes if you want to do, I don't know, uh, a Jules Vern, Vernian looking type of thing. Um, yeah, pretty cool. All right, thanks for watching, everybody.